Hello everyone, I am back again with another video and today we will talk about what is the difference between VM and containers. So many people uh, know about virtual machines and containers but what is the difference between them and when to use what that we will see today. So containers and virtual machines are very similar resource which is used for virtualization. So virtualization is a process in which is system singular resources such as RAM, CPU, disk or networking can be virtualized and represented as a multiple resource. The, the key differentiator between containers and virtual machine is that virtual machine virtualizes on entire machine down to the hardware layer and containers only virtualize software above the operating system level. So you can see in the diagram or on the screen what is the difference between virtual machines and containers where virtual machines have infrastructure and then we have hypervisor so on top of uh, our hardware infrastructure we have, we have hypervisor and then virtual machines each have their own operating systems okay but in case of containers we have the infrastructure which is the hardware you can understand and then we have the host operating system and then we have the containers engine so kernels and based and on top of that we have the different containers so this is the key difference Now, here uh, you can see clearly what is the difference. Uh, so, operating system is common for containers, whereas in virtual machines, there is no uh, limitations on the uh, host operating system. Okay, each VM can have their own operating system. So, for example, VM1 can have the Windows, VM2 can have uh, Linux and VM3 can have Unix or Mac OS, anything is possible and all this is getting possible through the hypervisor okay so VM is a piece of software so virtual machines is a piece of software that allows you to install other software inside inside of it so you basically can control it virtually as opposed to installing the software directly from the on the computer Whereas container uh, is a so for containers, uh, it is a kind of software which is installed on some host operating system. Application running on VM system can run different OS, while application running in container environments share a single operating system. VM virtualizes the computer system, while container virtualizes the operating system only, not the whole, uh, not till the hardware layer. VM size is very large, while the size of container is very light. And that is a few megabytes only. VM takes minutes to run due to larger size, while containers takes a few seconds to run. VM uses a lot of system memory, while containers require very less memory. VM is more secure, while containers are less secure. So this is an example again for virtual machines and containers where you can see the infrastructure remains same, but operating system on top of infrastructure is not there present in the in case of virtual machines and on top of operating system we have this container engine that plays a main important role in case of containerization in case of vms you can see that each is having each vm has its own operating system and you can treat this like as independent application uh, computers so each vm can be treated as a separate uh, computer system where you can install the applications, minor file libraries, etc. So virtualization uh, virtualize the hardware resource, whereas con uh, containerization virtualize only the operating system resource. VM requires the computer OS installation for every VM, uh, but in case of containerization, that is not needed. It installs container only over a host operating system. The kernel is installed again for every virtualized OS. Whereas in case of controlization, only the underlying host operating system kernel is used. So VM is typically heavyweight compared to the uh, containerization or containers. Uh, VM has limited performance. Uh, containerization has or uh, containers have native performance. VM is fully isolated, and for containers, it is just at the process level isolation we have. Docker is one of the containers that we use every day for application uh, installing or application deployment where we have this docker engine and uh, in case of vms we have the hypervisor 
so the difference remains same uh, for docker because it is a container so each vm in case of virtual machines each vm runs its own os whereas docker all kernels have the same kernel for the host in vm the boot up time is uh, in minutes that is more compared to containers where it is in just in seconds vm snapshots are used as sparingly whereas in docker images are built incrementally on top of the another layer like layers we don't have version control here uh, in docker images can have different uh, versions we cannot run couple of cup, uh, more than one couple of vm on an average laptop but in case of containers since it takes less memory uh, can run many docker containers in a single laptop and only one vm can be started from one set of vm x and vm dk whereas uh, for docker multiple docker containers can be started from one docker image so docker is lightweight vm is a heavyweight docker shares the same host operating system whereas vm shares separate os is there uh, but vm gives us fully uh, full isolation uh, but docker gives only uh, process level isolation uh, it takes more time to boot up vm but docker takes less time in seconds and vm uses more resources whereas docker uses less resources performance uh, is limit uh, for vm it has limited performance and uh, for docker it has native performance so thank you so much for watching today's video and if you think the video is helpful do like the video and subscribe to the channel and for any queries write in the comment section